Hello you guys, it's me guy 995 and if you hear some noise in my background, it's probably because my fan, it's it's hot in my room, and also my family members talking, so just refrain from that and ignore it. Now, today we're going to be talking about why 2D anime women is better. Now, I know I'm going to be putting myself out on the internet, and literally I might get a lot of attention from saying this, but I have to speak my feelings about this because I'm getting hurt from all this and I'm probably not the only one who's all, um, getting hurt. There's probably also other guys out there that feels the same way I am, but this video is for you guys. For you guys that are out there that's feeling the same way like I am. But anyway, let's go on with the video. Now, why is 2D anime women better? Well, if you're a person like me who bad, had bad experience with real women, of course it's going to happen to you. Or it's gonna eventually happen to you where you can someday in the future you're gonna put your foot down just say you're tired of this you give up you literally just want to be locked in your room and just isolated from everybody that's how you're gonna feel like that I mean this only for the um, guys out there who who's been treated like crap or been walked on and I've been there trust me like literally on my grand night on Disneyland like, I just see a lot of romantic people just walking around having a good time. And I'm just there sitting on the bench by myself. And all the girls that walked past me just ignored me. But that's not the main reason why I feel like this. Like, there's some other times where, like, um, let's say, like, I was close to having a relationship. But then it never happened. But every single time I set a meeting place to meet that person person for the first time even though it's going to escalate for me going out pretty soon but every single time that happens the person always turn tail and never show up that always happens to me and I also have another reason but it's privacy I'm not going to explain it but yeah so all those bad experiences made me the, re the person I am today and I, I literally say you know what why am I even doing this? I question myself. Why am I doing this? I'm wasting my time. Like, literally, I just have to accept my fate that I'm a loner. I'm meant to be alone. And us guys out there that also feel the same way I do, this goes to for you. You'll probably feel the same way. So that's why I said this video is belong to you. But, however, fast forward to time, and I just realized that there is something, something, that made me turn a new leaf and I want thanks to Japan for providing this for guys like us that feels this way because like I said we're not the only ones who feel like this like take Japan for example like there is some guys in Japan that doesn't want to date at all who doesn't want to like literally wants to be with a girl at all they prefer their um, anime women their wife and that's why I'm trying to touch up on. That's why I'm trying to say thank you for Japan to actually introducing the like the anime community to us Western audience, us from the United States. If it weren't from them, we wouldn't be discovering anything new like this. Or who could have said the worst could actually happen. So we never know what could happen actually in our future. So we never know. So that's why I'm saying thank you for Japan for giving us this um like a reason for us to hold on to life like literally anime women is the best and i am grateful for um japan for actually delivering the content like that associated with our favorite waifus like you have body pillows you have figures you have like t-shirts accessory visual novel games and the list just goes on and on and on like for guys like us us loner guys could like make ourselves preoccupied on something just trying to ignore our other problems like literally i feel like i grew up i grew up like i literally became a new person like back before i was like depressed and all like i had anxiety and everything because i couldn't get a girlfriend or anything like that like that happened to me so um now i want to say thank you japan for actually giving us this stuff when i discovered anime and when i discovered anime women i was really amazed of what kind of con i mean how much content japan puts out 
when it comes to us guys that's dealing with these problems. Like, some of the, mostly the creators that put out content like this are mostly guys that, that feels our pain. Like, some Japanese guys that probably feels our pain. Like, we got, like, visual novels, we got body pillows, like, we also got anime with fan service for crying out loud. Like, literally, it literally makes me happy to be an anime fan till this day. And now, the number one thing I want to point out why anime women is better is because, um, their personality. Now, there might be that one anime that you watch and then each girl has their own personalities. Personality? Ugh, can't even talk. Yeah, but the biggest thing is about why 2D women is better is their personality. Like, it literally, like, when you look at that character or whatever waifu you fell in love with, it makes you like, damn, man, why all, why, why can't I have, like, a actual legit person with this type of personality? Like, the personality of a 2D woman is nice. I love it. Especially the Sundere women. The Sundere women, oh, don't get me started with them. I love Sundere waifus a lot like for example I like Kisara and I'm not gonna tell you where she's from so keep it a down low um but my favorite waifu is Katsuragi even though she's not a Sundere but I mostly like blondie waifus to be honest with you especially the reason why I like Katsuragi is because she's blondie and she has like the little school uniform on to be honest with you I like I like um how Japan um, Japan school uniform look for the girl look like in the girls and on top of that you put that together with a blonde uh, waifu it, it, it makes her look really attractive that's why I like about Katsuraki she looks really attractive and um, yeah so mainly the personality is the first reason now number two it's also it's also um, you don't have to deal with any Heartbreaks. Literally, that's that's the main reason why I'm doing this video. Is because um, in the past I had some heartbreaks, and granted, just let you know, even though anime women is not real, of course you're not going to get any heartbreaks. But it's just that, like I said, it's there for you to escape from reality. So yeah, so that's the second reason why you don't have to put up with heartbreaks or any of that things like that. And the third reason is also um, content. Yeah, I know this is gonna be like this. Is not gonna be a good comparison, but um, I'm just literally putting out why 2D women is better. But yeah, content, like content, like um, you have, like let's say if you're you have a waifu that has like a lot of accessories, or she's in a lot of content, like let's say an anime, video game, visual novel a hentai you name it like there might be a waifu that you treasure that had that's in those type of things and also have a lot of accessories like body pillows uh, figurines and wall scrolls shoot man if you have a waifu like that then congrats on you you have like a lot of content to collect to make your own waifu um room or like literally Oh my god, I don't know how to say that word, but yeah, you just have much more content for their waifu. I mean, granted, there's some characters that's not in every um, thing that's just listed on there, like Division novels, but I'm not going to um, literally say it all over again because it's going to drag this video out longer. But leaving out to my fourth reason, hentai. Yeah, I don't know if you guys expect me to tackle this, but I'm going to keep this video advertise friendly so I'm not literally going to show anything inappropriate and I'm going to try to censor it the best way I can so I can keep it advertised friendly but yeah um hentai like hentai for your anime women or I mean your anime waifus I have to say that sorry about that but yeah it's more content I mean no not more content uh here we go I'm dragging I'm coming back from part I mean three uh, but anyway, yeah, hentai. Like, hentai is much better than your real average porn, to be honest with you, because it has plot, and 
that's the main reason why everybody loves it is mostly for the plot it has a decent plot and not only that it's just it's just i literally i literally can't tell what else is better in hentai because each person has their own reasons why hentai is better but for me it's mostly plot and also um just a lot of waifus who you could literally just throw in your harem like i did like see here i have a picture of me of me and my waifus i literally created my own harem there we go you can do the same thing it's possible even though granted they're not real i still i still love love them to to be honest with you like i literally have a place in my heart for them like i have a lot of waifus accessories like i have a hentai hat i have like a shirt shirt and everything like hentai would like hentai is starting to grow in the um industry it's really growing popular to this day like there's a lot of hentai visual novels and hentai haven i don't know if you heard of them like there, there's a lot of content of them like man like we came a long way in the anime community like it's growing really fast now i can't wait to see how many more content we will have in the hentai community and also the anime community in the, in the next future like i'm really glad to be a um, anime fan and i hope we keep getting more um hentai in the future especially from faku hopefully they add more content or they could just surprise us with more hentai stuff but that's the note that's that's why hentai is literally better than i mean this wipe what makes the our wife is better no i meant to say what makes to the anime better sorry you guys i'm kind of nervous tackling this down because i'm not really that person who literally just expressed my voice online but anyway, we're going to the final reason. And the final reason is fantasies. Now, this one is really true because don't forget, us humans, when we go to sleep, we dream a lot. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, this one is the most important thing. Dreaming is really is really legit. It does happen. And to show you proof, I mean, I mean, just to tell you guys a little story, I literally had a legit dream where I was literally, when I literally was hanging out with my waifu, and then when I woke up, I literally said, damn it, man, how am I going to be able to get that dream that I had? I had a really good dream. Now, it might not happen all the time, because like I told you, I just wish, I just told you guys, I wish I had that dream again. So... Um, but it will happen at certain times. If you're literally dedicated your love and passion towards your anime waifus, it will happen eventually. Like, how it happened to me is just, I literally just made it a thing. Like, I literally just focused on nothing but 2D women, like anime women. And I just literally got an amazing dream. I woke up to amazing, I had a, uh, I had an amazing sleep and I had an amazing dream. Like I literally woke up feeling like I was fresh and I was in the next day I was already ready for work and I was literally had a lot of energy. So yeah, so fantasies are well, actually a thing and it really is important on this list because we human beings we do dream sometimes and it does happen. So if you if you want to have that good dream i mean who knows you guys in the comment or you guys watching this video it might actually happen to you you might probably just go to bed and you had a good dream just imagining you um with an anime with it. i mean with your anime life i mean it can happen you can also practice fantasies like let's say if you're meditating or anything like and you're thinking something in your mind you like you could create your own fantasy inside your mind when you're meditating i don't know if that's going to help you to get the dream more often or the fantasies of you being with your special life more often but i'm gonna be honest with you guys even if you do get it i promise you guys it's really good it's worth it i'm gonna say this now but i forgot to say this during the, um, during the middle of the video but yeah um yeah so yeah, so anime women is actually unique. 
really unique like 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 take it like take a chance to see how many women have like a phone on their back pocket i'm just i'm just throwing out an example here like every woman does the same thing like they leave their phone in their back pocket and it like it literally slips out easily and then not only that they always they always try their best to look good and to like literally show off on every i mean to show off on every guy that's literally almost all of them and then you have some women that literally complain why can't i have a why can i never find a boyfriend but literally it's merely their fault because they're being picky at the end of the day now you guys this all this is all true because to show you proof this is coming from japan if i don't know if you know but japan it's slowly their their birth rate is slowly declining it actually is kind of slowly declining because not a lot of guys out there wants to wants to have a girlfriend or literally just want to have a wife or anything they just don't want to do do and they, they don't want to deal with all any of that like literally you have like guys out there in japan who like marries their anime wife like if i had the guts to do that i would do it but to me i'm a kind of like a wuss i'm a coward i wouldn't do that but still to this day i still love my anime women but but going on go, i mean moving on but if you think about it it's slowly happening out here in america believe it or not i mean you don't have to believe me but you could probably just look it up anywhere and you'll probably find it that it is slowly declining like in america like it's like i don't know how you could search it like you'll probably find something like um not 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 that much people having sex or something like that you'll probably found it around the internet um yeah but it's slowly happening in america out here too so yeah because some guys like us can't put up with that anymore because we had our hearts broken like it's gonna be like you're in the future for the guy for the guys that's like me that that had that bad experience one day they're gonna grow strong and put their foot down just say i'm tired of these thoughts they need to be taught a lesson and just become thought slayers starting to ignore ignore women and then just literally isolate themselves from women and just literally just be alone for the whole time of their life like it's actually gonna happen i mean i'm i i said i mean it's not gonna actually happen it probably will who knows but the like literally the internet just tells you like you literally could just look it up on the internet that that just explains shows proof that it's probably gonna happen and I said keyword probably. So don't literally just mis mis um, read what I'm saying and it's not gonna happen or it's actually gonna happen, but it probably will. Like literally just look up the birth rate in Japan and literally in America and not that much people um, is literally wanting to deal with all that. Don't want to deal with having kids or any of that or don't wanna to have to deal with having a wife or anything. Because at the end of the day, the most important thing is trust. You need to have trust. And not everybody in this world trusts one another. So, and that part, that word, especially is important when attaining a relationship. If you don't have trust, then, and then it's not gonna work well. So, that's why I maybe that uh, to the women is better because all the reasons I just listened to my video. And especially the biggest one is trust. You have to trust the person before you actually make it official, make it a relationship. That's the most important part of taking a relationship. And you can't sometimes have that. So that's why some guys like me just look the other way and just prefer anger. Now, I, I'm sorry if this video, I'm, I'm literally just like, like not getting the words out there again i already said i'm nervous but yeah that's gonna be it for this video and if you're a guy that experienced like i mean if you're a guy that's hit me up on discord um, my discord is one of the guys who are we can just chat about it and chat about our problems and everything like that feel free to chat about it. and if you're a guy who have a friend that's like that um show them this video 
maybe this bit and if and if he was probably like me how before i was depressed and everything because of this situation yeah show go ahead and show him this video immediately because so he could feel he could feel like he could stop that depression and actually overcome himself just, so just show him the video okay well this is a little guy 995 have a great day